Includes four minifigures with weapons, 2212th Battalion Clone Troopers and two Airborne Clone Troopers. Features a tri-droid with a rotating head, possible legs and three flick missiles. Includes four new blasters that really fire. Features new Airborne Clone Trooper helmet design and body detailing, Tri-droid, with legs folded, measures over 5 inches 14 centimeters high, 3 inches 8 centimeters long and 2 inches 7 centimeters wide. Help the 212th Battalion Clone Troopers take on the Octoptera Tri-droid with the LEGO Star Wars Utapau Troopers Battle Pack. But watch out! With a rotating head, possible legs and three flick missiles, the dangerous Tri-droid is more than a match for the Clone Troopers. Includes four minifigures with weapons, 2212th, Battalion Clone Troopers and two Airborne Clone Troopers. Review, if you want to build up your Star Wars LEGO collection with some anonymous troopers, this is a great set, and it includes a nifty droid to fill in your Separatist droid army. You get two each of the two types of clone troopers, then one droid. Specifically, 2x212, Battalion Clone Troopers and two Airborne Clone Troopers, and one X Octopara Tri-Droid. This set comes with the new blaster guns where you can click the gun and it will actually propel out the translucent blue LEGO round plate one by one, 4073, 6141 15570 that you see on the tip. Yes, this comes with several spares of this bit, because they will fire out pretty far, and will get lost fast. The clone faces are still part of the prequel designed faces and not the Clone Wars cartoon faces the Clone Wars cartoon heads have really big eyes, which are the ones that I prefer. As a standalone or a complementary set for something bigger like the Republic gunship or a Tay Walker, it's a good set.